Create your own storybook scene this holiday with our easy construction instructions. These little chocolate houses are such a great project and once you see how simple they are, you're gonna wanna whip up a whole village. So you can either use a five ounce chocolate bar or an eight ounce, but today I'm using the five. And you can download the templates to make your houses from bhg.com for both the little house and the bigger house. So once you've got your templates printed out like this, you cut them out and you'll have two of these and you should have four of these. These two are gonna be for the front of your house and for the back of your house, and it's got that little peak at the top. That's very important because that's where the roof pitches down. So you got front and back, two sides, and both sides of the roof. So to cut out your bars, you just kind of lay down one of your chocolate bars. You wanna make sure that you lay it with the front side up, like that. And then I'm just gonna stick my template Use the straight edges of your chocolate bar. You know, don't reinvent the wheel, so just line this up right with the bottom so you make sure you've got some nice 90 degree angles back there. And then I'm just gonna use a nice serrated blade like this. And when you're cutting, especially the pitch for the front and the back of your house, you wanna make sure you really hold down and press down hard on that peak and on the side so that your peak doesn't break while you're cutting. And I'm just gonna line it up like that and just start nice and slow, kind of back and forth. And now we're gonna cut the other side. Perfect, so now I've got one side cut and I've got my front side cut. Now, here's an important tip when you're working with this template, you wanna make sure that the front side of your house and the back side are actually kind of snugged in by the outside walls. So you don't wanna do this. You wanna make sure you attach it on the outside of the front side of your wall. I've got my little scraps here that I put into a bowl, and I'm actually gonna microwave this, and this is gonna be really crucial because the melted chocolate is gonna be the mortar for our little house. So I've got some melted chocolate here, and I'm actually gonna use this to be the little mortar for our house. So I'm going to just put some generous amount right up along this edge. And then I'm going to just attach my house like that. Just kind of press it together. So once you've got your joints together, you can actually just smooth down your bead like that so that all your joints are nice and smooth. How about that? So I've got my four walls set up here, and you can see that I put the two peaked walls inside of the side walls. That's really important because when you go to put your roof on, if you don't do it like this, your roof's not gonna fit. So you're never gonna get a really perfect joint at your rooftop. You're always gonna need to fill it in with some melted chocolate. And that's all there is to it. So let these set up for a while so that they're nice and sturdy to decorate.